Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Outus. In this video, I'll be showing you how to list items on eBay from CJ Drop Shipping. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So what do we need to do first? Well, first things first is you need to have an eBay account. So go to ebay.com and go to the My eBay section here and from then on, create your account. Now, once you've created your account, you need to verify some things here. So once you log in or once in the main homepage for eBay, go ahead and hover over My eBay here and look for the option that says Selling. Now under selling, what we need to do is we need to scroll down a bit here and look for the selling promotions. Now in this case, make sure that you have 200 items so that you can actually list every month. Now in this case, if you have 200 or at least a significant number of amount here, you should be able to start using or start listing items from CJ Drop Shipping. Now in this case, the next thing you want to do is we need to visit CJ Drop Shipping, and from here you want to create your account. Now typically at the top right of your screen you should see a sign up or sign in button. Now in this case, once you have your account, once you've logged in, we're now ready to start connecting our two accounts here. Now at the top left here, you should see the authorization. So in this case, go ahead and scroll down a bit until you see the eBay option here and go ahead and click on it. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to click on the add store option that you see on your screen there. And from here, what we need to do is we need to authorize eBay on our shop. Now in this case, it might ask you to verify if you're really human. So you might see a pop up or another page before you actually get in here. Now in this case, just follow the indications, any information that they provide, and also all the information that will be, that will be provided into CJ Drop Shipping. Now in this case, once you've done that, we are now ready to start listing items. Now for us to start listing items, we need to search for the items that we want to sell. In this case, let's go ahead and go to the search options here. And maybe I want to say somewhere like, for example, a shoe. I want to sell a shoe. So just uh, enter the following, which is a shoe keyword and just press on enter. And from here, we should be able to see a list of shoes that we could actually sell. Now in this case, under the shoe section here, what we need to do is we need to select for that product. So maybe I want to choose this product here. So let's just click on it. Now, in this case, it should open up the product page for that specific item. And you should be able to see the color, the size, the style, and shipping free, a fee, service fee, total price on it, and a lot more information. Now, in this case, how do we actually start listing this into our eBay account? Now, for us to start selling or listing this into our eBay account, we need to click on the list option here. So in this case, it should redirect you to another pop-up here, which in this case, you should be able to start seeing the variations of the product, like the sizes, the SKU, CJ color, and the prices on it. Now, you also need to indicate the price for it. So in this case, I would suggest you to visit all the products here because sometimes variation can actually cost more. Now, in this case, make sure that you have uh, the correct pricing on it. Now, in this case, once you have entered all the details here, you could go ahead and go to others here. Again, you need to enter some information about it. Now, in this case, you have two options for you to start selling this. You have the list it now option and the edit before listing. Now, if you click on the edit before listing here, you should be able to see another page. Where in this case, you should be able to change a few details about the product that you want to sell. So, for example, the product title here, the tags, the description, the images, the variants, the shipments, and the other details that you have. Now, in this case, for you to start selling this, you could go ahead and just provide all the desired details here. So let's just say we want to select all this product here. And from here, we want to click on list it now. Now, it's going to first enter or ask for the enter quantity here. So I would suggest you to uh, make sure they enter the quantity first. So Again, you should be able to see it in here, so just look for it. So the quantity section as well as the pricing section should be located at the rightmost side in here. Now in this case, you could go ahead and enter the price here. Like for example, I want to say it is around, just say it is going to be around 1,000 pesos here. And the closing quantity, maybe I want to say it is going to be around 100. Now in this case, you should be able to start selecting all the variants that you have. So maybe I want to only sell this variant here. And from here, we want to fill all the details. So let's just go ahead and fill that. And once you've added it, you could go ahead and click on list it now. 
Also, you need to enter the store price here, so make sure that you enter that. So maybe I want to say it's going to be a thousand Philippine peso here, but we want to increase this one. We don't want to actually uh, be less than the actual amount, so it might be more. Let me just estimate this one. So maybe this price is here is good. Now in this case, let's go ahead and click on list it now, and it should actually uh, ask you to actually uh, start po uh, posting it again. If there are any missing details, go ahead and provide that. Now, once you click on the list it now option and you get this error here, it means you need to verify your account for or request assistance from eBay. Now, in this case, for you to reach out to eBay support, you need to go back to eBay, go to the very top here and choose the help and contact. Now, under the help contact section, what we need to do next is we need to scroll down a bit here, look for the contacts page and just click on the contact us. Now, from here, what we need to do next is we need to choose the account. And from here, we want to click on start selling on eBay. And from here, what we need to do next is choose the option that says chat with our automated assistants. Now, you might be wondering why automated assistant here. Well, in this case, we need to ask for a agent. Now, in this case, once you've started chatting here with the automated assistant, you could just go ahead and just say you need assistance on start selling on eBay through CJ drop shipping. Now, also, you could go ahead and indicate also that you need assistance on verifying your account and also a few things regarding your account. Now, once you've done that, you should be able to start connecting with an agent on eBay. And once you've verified your account and fulfilled all the necessary details, you can just go back into CJ Drop Shipping and click on Listen Now. And that should actually connect your account into eBay and you should be able to see it in your listings. Now, in this case, you could go to My eBay again and go to Selling here and you should be able to see all the listings that you have right now. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.